the, the semi-finals was really really disappointing against England. We were unsuccessful. It was a, a tough game for us. Let us not judge our team only by this performance. To get to that number one spot, it doesn't happen overnight. You have to play good cricket over a period of time. I know that uh, the semi-finals was really really disappointing against India. Uh, and I am in the same boat. Uh, we are all well wishes of Indian cricket. Uh, 168 at Adelaide wasn't a great total because uh, the dimensions of the ground are completely different. Side boundaries are really, really short. So I would have said maybe, you know, 190 or so or around that would have been a good total. 168 uh, at Adelaide is equivalent to like 100 and 50 or so on any other ground and to me that is not a competitive total so let's accept that we did not put up a good total on the board and uh, so was the case with our bowling where it came to uh, you know, picking wickets we were unsuccessful it was uh, a tough game for us 170 no loss that's that's a bad defeat rather disappointing but uh, also let us not judge our team only by this performance you know? because uh, we have been world number one t20 side as well and to get to that number one spot it doesn't happen overnight you have to play good cricket over a period of time and that is what the team has done uh, by no means i'm trying to say that you know so these kind of performances are okay players also didn't want to go out and fail Players also wanted to go out and win for the country. But every day it doesn't happen. In sport, these ups and downs are there. So it, I feel it cannot be, you know, victory is ours and losses are theirs.